Hey loves, welcome back to the channel. So I'm here to bring you a hair review, honey. So look at this hair. This is really pretty. I'm going to brush it out because I know it looked crazy. I just took some pictures and stuff. So anyways, this is from Fan... I don't know if I'm going to pronounce it right, but it's from Van Love Hair Mall. And every time I have something in my hand and I talk. But anyways, yeah, let me just brush it out. It can stand to have a few more tracks because I only used two bundles. I didn't want it to be too wiggy, but... um. I'm going to go back and add some more. Luckily, I colored all three. So, I think I'm good. All right, I think I'm fine. Maybe. So, we're just going to work with this right now. Um. So, anyways, I don't know. I feel like this side needs to be way fuller. There we go. Get some spreading going on. It's like the curls are all clumped together. And I hate that. So, um, And I need some more volume up there. So anyways, let's go ahead and get into the hair review. So the hair arrived in this box right here. I thought this was really cute. It says, I guess their slogan is hair in your hair. So this is the box. Bundles came in here. And um, super convenient to carry. So your beautician will be like, girl. You fancy. But, and the hair is actually very inexpensive. When I looked on the website, I think it was like 125 for three bundles. And it was, you had a choice between Brazilian, Malaysian, Peruvian, and Indian. So I was like, damn, you know, for each one, it's like the same price. It's not going to go up just because it's a different type of hair. So I did get the loose wave. I'm assuming it's Brazilian because I wasn't really, spe it wasn't specified. Um, the, I have a 14 inch closure and then I have... I feel like I have two 22 inch bundles and maybe a 20 because two of them look the same exact length but on the computer I'm looking over here it says I think it says I had an 18 20 and 22 but it really didn't seem like that but anyways that's beside the point the hair was pre ombre for me so I will insert a picture it just makes it easier for me I don't have to go through bleaching I don't have to dive through the smell so yeah um this color is actually achieved very oddly so let me get into it so the hair took color very well as you can see there is absolutely probably none no blonde streaks at all okay um the hair like i said took color very well i had no problem with coloring the hair but so for the color um i was like okay cool gonna do some burgundy and then I was like, looked at my burgundy. I was like, oh, I don't think I got enough burgundy. So let's, I threw some red cherry with some, what was that? It was like a dark, mm, what was the color? I forget the name of it, but it was like a really dark red, like a deep, deep red. Like I, if I was to ombre some hair, I would use that red like up here and then go into a darker, I mean a lighter color red, I guess. Um, but anyways, so it was like, let's just call it um, uh, a, a wild cherry dark something. <laughs> a wild dark cherry, all right? So let's say we had to throw that in there, and then I was like, I still don't know if that's going to be enough. And then I don't want it to be too dark. So I threw some more red cherry, and um, then I threw a little bit of paprika. And that's why you're getting like this maybe hence the orange-ish color coming through because I did mix some of that in there so I did get a pretty color like I didn't know what to expect because when it was dark and drying and stuff it just looked like and eh. I was like it's gonna be really dark like it's gonna be way too dark so anyways I got a nice color I got a decent color I have one bundle left I only put two bundles in and the closure I use the hot glue method it's convenient for me right now. I still make units using the traditional sew method, but um, for the most part, a lot of people oil, oil, a lot of people order the hot glue method. You know, it's cheaper and it's faster. So instead of seven to 21 days, it probably take like seven days. Uh, sewing method probably takes, just depending on what I have going on, I'll say seven to 15 ish, but I give myself 21 days for a little bit of leeway for the company to send the hair and all that good stuff. So this hair is absolutely beautiful. Now they were saying, you know, 
and you know tb what is it t1b slash uh let me see yeah t1b slash 27 ombre is not that popular and i'm like oh i was like well i'm just really really tired of black hair okay uh my hair is like a natural dark 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 brown close to black and then the wigs i make are mostly black so i'm like i really want not a natural color um i don't want the natural 1b color you know what I'm saying? i want some color so they ended up sending me an ombre and i got happy um and i achieved what i was going for actually i wish it was a little more red but a lot of people you know liked it and a lot of people on snap really liked it um so i was happy with it and then um not to mention it's homecoming <laughs> so i was like i really want this burgundy hair for homecoming so i got what i wanted um what else did i want to mention i do have a coupon code you can use the quanta three for any order of any amount or you can use the quantify for any amount i guess order total of 159 dollars or more so this company says that their hair is not chemically treated it's directly from the donor and then yada 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 <laughs> and it's then it doesn't say remy it just says unprocessed virgin hair so for it to be so cheap i was like cool um <laughs> i know that was corny cool but anyways i was like really satisfied with the pricing and i was like you know if anybody ever wants to order an ombre unit i'll probably just go ahead and order the ombre hair from this company and even after coloring and stuff and after they bleached it it still looks good it's not super frizzy you know it doesn't have those flyaways at the end too much and so yeah it looks really good for it to be bleached and colored so let me get about your face <laughs> so overall i'm completely satisfied with the company i'm completely satisfied with the hair i decided to go for a side part because i've been doing a lot of middle parts lately um so yeah the closure did pretty well Next time, I would just, you know, part it on my head because I'm so used to doing it on the mannequin. So it's like sometimes the part like goes, you know, like it's just not, it's not right. You understand? I would want it to go like boom, you know, like a swoopy swoop. But it just, it's like straight. So I can fix that. It's an easy fix. But yeah, just saying. Is there anything else I want to mention? I will leave everything in the description. I told you about the coupon code. Um, told you my lengths. I told you the hair held up pretty straight. It was a loose wave texture after coloring. It was kind of straightish, wavyish. Um, I went in with my curling wand, like a what is it, a half inch? I think it's the half inch one, the barrel, and just wand curled it. Um, and then brush it out and went about my day so that's all i did with this hair hope you guys enjoyed this video i would definitely recommend van love and honestly i've never heard of the company it's not like through aliexpress or anything like that they have their own website so i was like cool van love hair mall and yeah so i'm not gonna keep you guys any longer i think i rambled enough um i'm happy with my results uh yeah that's all i really have to say they did pretty well when they bleached the hair. It wasn't such a blunt, you know, bleaching. I wish the closure was a little bit longer because you can see, you can see, like, you know, it's just like a little bit too much black up there. But other than that, we're good. We're good. <laughs> uh, thank you guys so much for joining once again.